All new motorcycle Suzuki GSX S1000 GT review model. Replacing the fairly ill-conceived and pretty ugly GSX S1000F, the GSX S1000 GT arrived in 2022 and was bang on the mark. Finally, Suzuki had listened to customer comments and built a proper sports tourer to take on the likes of the Ninja 1000 SX, which it has to be noted has long been a strong seller for Kawasaki. With the ability to have Suzuki's own color-matched panniers fitted, a comfortable riding position, decent tech, strong inline four motor, agile chassis, and good looks. The GT also boasted a fairly competitive price tag. Unsurprisingly, it sold very well and in its first full year on sale it was the UK's best-selling sports tourer. Since that date interest in the GT has diminished somewhat, a situation not helped by the arrival of the tech-heavy crossover GSX S1000 GX. But now that finance packages are starting to mature there are lots of used GT out there for sale. If you are after a sport tourer, it is a very good option. Not the most technologically advanced it has to be said, but a good, solid, performer that is hard to really fault. Suzuki GSX S1000 GT Price Prices for the GT start at £7,500, which is higher than you might expect. Oddly for a touring bike, there are very few GTs with big miles on their clocks and the most you are likely to find is around the 8,000 mile mark.